guys, it's Cherry Ann, and welcome back to my channel and to Vlogmas Day 8. <laughs> I thought today I would share some of the things that I've gotten while I've been home. Let's start with American Eagle because I didn't want to bring all that out there. I did purchase some underwear when they were having a sale at Aerie and it was 10 for 35. I don't ever shop at American Eagle or at Aerie but 10 pairs of underwear for $35 is a really good deal. Anyway, I decided to try Aerie out and I got them. I haven't worn them yet, but they look really cute. And then I also from them purchased a pair of pajama pants, long gray pajama pants. I also purchased a tank top from them. And then from Target, I also got a new set of pajamas, which are super cute and so fun for the winter. And it's from my favorite brand from Target, which is Gilligan and O'Malley. And I think if you are looking for really great pajamas, definitely go to them. They have pajama sets that look a lot like the Eberge pajamas, but at a much cheaper price because obviously from Target and they're amazing. I love them so much. I pretty much only buy that brand for pajamas now. I thought this would just be fun to show you. I got this at, in the little Christmas section. This is the Rudolph's Mix Indulgent, Indulgent Trail Mix. This has chocolate covered cereal, graham cracker bites, M&Ms, and peanut butter cups. And this is just a little like one serving. Just kidding, two serving box. And I thought I would also mention this because I love this. A lot of times I buy this so that I can eat it at work as my like break snack. This is the Nature's Valley Biscuits made with cocoa almond butter. I really like these. These aren't like the healthiest thing for you, but I think it's a better option. You probably saw me using this, these two things in a past video. And I got two nail polishes from Essie. They're both very shimmery colors and that's not something I usually go for, but I thought since I'm not at work right now and I know these are not Disney look approved, I would try them out. I'm actually wearing this white one, which is called Going Steady on my nails, which you can kind of see this iridescent white color. And then this one, which is called Seeing Stars, is on my toes right now. It's just a coppery brown iridescent shade. The next thing I have here is this CoverGirl Exhibitionist Mascara in the waterproof, very black color. I always buy waterproof mascara when I can, if it's offered. I will always choose the waterproof kind just because my lashes, I don't know, it's the only thing that really holds a curl to my lashes. But like I was saying in yesterday's video, my lashes are so short right now and they need some help. So I've been using, or I just started using a new lash again. From Amazon, I purchased this book. This is Just the Essentials, How Essential Oils can heal your skin, improve your health, and detox your life by Adina Grigor. My mom got for me this diffuser and essential oils from, I think the brand is called Vitruvi. And it got delivered to my Florida address, so it's already there, but I am trying to see if maybe essential oil oils can help with my eczema. And since I don't really know a lot about them, I thought I would purchase this book and read a little bit about it. I haven't started it yet, but it looks kind of interesting. If you guys have any tips, any tricks with essential oils, any combos you like, let me know. I'm gonna see how it works out. We also went to um, another bookstore when we went shopping the other day, my mom and I, and it's called Indigo. 
This is apparently a Canadian brand. I have never heard of it before, but I went in there or I saw it from across the way and I asked my mom if we could go in because I love bookstores, I love reading and it just looked so fun in there. So I asked if we could go in and honestly, it is probably the nicest bookstore I've seen in a really long time. The one thing that I was looking for that I was actually looking for in Florida and I couldn't find it anywhere, it was, so I ended up purchasing it on my Kindle. So I've been reading it on my Kindle. It's the new Michelle Obama book, Becoming, but I really wanted it in a hard copy. It's just one of those books that I just wanted to be able to hold and keep. But like I said, I've been reading it on my Kindle, but they had it in store at Indigo. And so my mom and I both got a copy. I'm just so glad I now have this book in my hands. I've already been reading this. This is a really, really good book. I highly recommend it. You don't need to like get into politics or anything like that. I think she's an amazing woman and I really love her. And I'm so excited that I have a hard copy of this book now. So this package is from Ilya. One of these I didn't purchase. It was like a gift with purchase. And I think it's this, this is the Ilya lip conditioner yeah in the in balmy days essentially it it's it's kind of like a set you're supposed to use balmy days in the morning and then balmy nights at night like when you're sleeping my lips are really chapped right now so let's try it no real scent to it it feels really nice this is the true skin serum foundation sample i guess that you get i don't wear foundation so i'm not going to use this this is the Ilia. I don't have to say that. It's the tinted lip conditioner with SPF 15 in the shade Kokomo. Kind of the same packaging, but just in a different color as the lip conditioner or as the balm. Comes off a little bit pinker on camera, but I thought it would just be a nice shade to wear every day. Something that I can just keep in my work bag. And then I have this. This is a finishing powder. This got pretty good reviews, I think, on Sephora and on their own website. So. This is a very large tub. I also typically don't buy tubs this big, but this is just uh, the soft finishing powder. It's in Fade Into You. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but it has. I still have the sticker on it, but it has a closure so I can turn it and lock it so it doesn't spill out. I actually really like that. That's kind of nice. And then I have this. Oh, hi, Mom. This is a, another mascara. It's the Limitless lash mascara in the shade after midnight which was so hard to find anywhere i don't know what i'm going to do about this i'm actually going to contact them because they gave me a refund for this because they said this wasn't in stock and so they didn't send it to me here it is in my hand because Ilya said that they didn't have that mascara in stock i purchased it from blue mercury so now i have two i don't need to that's really strange that that happened. I also purchased this from Blue Mercury just because I didn't bring any lip balm with me. I don't know why I forgot. That's, it's, it was very, very strange. I purchased these from Kiehl's. I'm actually going to give one to my mom right now because I don't need three of these. It came in a set. This is just the Kiss, with, Kiss, Kiss Me With Kiehl's set. And it comes with three of their lip balms the original the cranberry and then this is the mint then from ulta i have this revlon mascara again waterproof and it's the volumazing mascara i got two of their instant maybelline instant age rewind concealer i didn't realize that they had expanded the color range for that and i actually think one of these is too dark for me the two shades i got were honey and golden golden is new i think i used to use honey previously when this first came out and then i ended up getting some nyx soft matte lip creams these are some of my favorite lip products so i thought i would try a few other colors whenever i purchase these because you can't really see the color or test it I always look up video, so I'm gonna link the video that I looked at or watched for swatches. So I got the shades Can, Zurich, and Rome. You'll see that these are all really neutral, which is what I prefer when I purchase the NYX Soft Matte Lip Creams. I do have, I think, one red color, but I prefer the nude ones just because these are not 
long lasting so they will not last you all day if you eat or drink anything these will definitely come off and i just think it's easier to touch up on the nudes than it is to keep touching up on something red so that's why i purchased these that's my haul i'm gonna call it a night two on this vlog just so i can start editing it but i hope you guys like this video and i will see you guys tomorrow for another day of vlogmas bye